Welcome back to It's Just Plastic. My name is Hound. That's right. You've seen the thumbnail. You know a statue I'm going to review today. Woo! I got the Iron Studios 110 scale US agent from the Falcon and Winter Soldier TV show. That was a Disney Plus show. Go check it out. If you're missing out, you ain't watched it yet, you are missing a dang good show. Now, Mr. U.S. Agent doesn't come out like this until the last little bit of the show. Not trying to ruin it for you, but just kind of give you an idea if uh, you do want to go watch it. There's the other side of the box. Top of the box. There's all the bottom of the box info. Yeah, uh, most of the show, he's uh, in his cap suit, which is pretty similar, but he doesn't come out in this until the very end, and uh, you know, you can kind of see the A of the cap suit right there. They just kind of did a paint job, just kind of switched it up, which I thought was okay, but I'm ready to see him. Oh, by the way, I ain't show you the back of it. There's the back of the box. Ooh, hashtag Iron Studios. Yeah, I'm ready to open this up. I thought that was okay for the show because we weren't focusing on U.S. Agent. We were focusing focusing on Falcon becoming Captain America. We had to touch on the John Walker U.S. Agent thing. I love U.S. Agent. He's one of my favorite characters, but he does go through some rough times, which I'm okay with. That's kind of the way this. That's kind of way things went in the show. Are in the comic books. So, uh, you know, gonna have to get into his storyline. His storyline's really good. Uh, hopefully, they'll do it justice. I cannot wait to see him in Thunderbolts. He's supposed to come up. I just posted another, I just posted a review for Thaddeus Thunderbolt from Red Hulk or Red Hulk. Um, so, go ahead and check that review out. Bam. Should be up here somewhere. Or should have been somewhere in this review. <laughs> but go ahead and check that out. Um, really excited that uh, I got to review both of these back to back. Especially because they go to very well together. Uh, but anyways, let's go ahead and bust this open. But first, hit the like, hit the subscribe. Check out all my links down below. Website, everything, music, blah, blah, blah. You know it. Go down below, check it. Links for Entertainment Earth discount down below. Macari, please. I got a lot of stuff coming up on Macari. You might want to check it out if you're a DC fan. I got lots of cool, especially death metal. Uh, DC's metal, death metal, whatever that. Um, I just I outgrew the room. I don't need them anymore. I got a lot of statues, a lot of figures, McFarland stuff, DC collectibles. Go check it out. Link down below. All right. Obviously, if this is a year later and you're watching this, they're probably not on there. But go ahead and check it out anyways. They may be. Who knows? <laughs> All right. Let's go ahead and pop this figure open. Or statue. Open. Let's go ahead. Let's see here. Wow, you guys are still on camera. Let's see what they got. It's pretty, pretty sturdy. Look at that. All right. This must be the front. I got Iron Studios straight up on the... I'm going to pause it for this. All right. I'm going to bust this open with you guys on camera. Let's hit it. Ooh, there it is. There he is. Very exciting. All right. Before I open up the man himself, let's look at the base. Ooh. Wow, that base has got some weight to it. Holy cow. Man, that thing is it's like it's made out of concrete itself. It looks like concrete, man. All right, there you go. Falcon and the Winter Soldier, U.S. Agent, Marvel Studios, Iron Studios. What's that say? Art Scale 110, Marvel. What's the stinker? Yeah, very cool. So, they are not numbered. There is no... Uh, specific number numbering system anywhere on here not even on the box let's go ahead and open this guy up and we'll move the part of the box out the way wow he looks really good y'all man he's gonna look great with my other figures oh 
Wow. Skin tone is great. Man, Iron Studios. If you do not have any Iron Studios statues, you are missing out. They do a fantastic job. Wow. I know that some of the some some people want bigger statues, but the 110 scale to me, it's about the same size as a. I'm gonna move the base too. So base, uh, just to kind of cover this real quick, has a square peg. Square peg. You'll see it in the 360 in the beginning of the the picture. You see the 360 that I post, but it kind of gives you an idea of what it looks like. There you go. But I want to go ahead and cover the rest of him. Oh, let's now show the base off all the way. Kind of linger that. Check that out. Look at that detail on the on the base. All the way around the cracking. Look at the see. There's the square peg. But look at the cracking in the concrete. I'll tell you that thing is sturdy. That thing ain't falling. But one, let me get back to my story. One ten scale, or what I was saying. One ten scale. Uh, I hate to keep using my <laughs> SPD Ranger here in every video, but he's still on my desk. So, kind of gives you an idea. This is a six inch scale figure. So, he's about what, seven and a half, something like that. Kind of gives you an idea. Yeah. Yeah, he's about seven and a half inches. So, that's a pretty good size. I mean, at a hundred bucks. For a seven inch scale statue, I mean, he is very sturdy, very well done. Let's go ahead and go to the red, look over some more of him. Oh man, look at that! Looks like him, uh, looks like the man that plays him. I mean, I always forget his name. He's a, he's a famous uh, person's son. I can't even think of his name. Russell Wyatt, that's it. That's it. just hit my head. Is Russell Wyatt? Is that it? Sounds about right. <laughs> Looks very good. Oh, look, he's missing the. Uh, he had like a uh, star or something in there. I forget what he had in there, but there's the A in the back, still shining. Very cool. Lots of detail. Lots of textures. I mean, this right here, you can tell, like, the Kevlar, you know, it's it's definitely, you can see it, like, that smooth, it's, actually, it's not smooth, it's got a little ridges, you can feel that with your finger, that smooth, that smooth, I mean, lots and lots of little details and textures to it. So, the box showed the egg blacked out, but it does have a gray section there, it's kind of a silverish grayish air color his eyes are hard to see the way he's looking down i think this looks better than the marvel legends figures the red and white they kind of messed that up when they did the figure but the statue this iron studio statue they they definitely hit that right i like to move his arm and stuff out the way but you know statues you can't do that lots of texture in the legs they i mean they touched on it all the way it looks like stitching like like you can see right here like it looks like stitching right there i mean they they did a fantastic job in making sure that look at the back of the knees looks like the back of the knees i mean like yeah boots look really good having trouble focusing all of a sudden there you go yeah really 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 nice how hard to focus on these uh boots here they don't like my camera don't really like seem to like that very happy with the way this turned out oh look you can even see they gave him uh see the finger color and the fingerless gloves his gun there There you go. Yeah. So. I was hoping to get my Captain America. I bought the uh, Falcon Captain America from Iron Studios as well. 
I was hoping to get that before I got this, but I hope you liked the quick review. So statues, not a lot to go over. Can't do articulation, can't do anything like that. But, you know, I'm very, very impressed with this uh, statue. It's very nice. Uh, Iron Studios always does a fantastic job. I have several of their statues and hoping to get more. I'm looking for the Falcon from... Uh, uh, they have one from Infinity War, and I believe uh, they have another one that is super hard to find. I can't. I think that one's from Civil War, uh, and I can't find that one hardly at all without paying and paying that kind of for money for an eight-inch statue is kind of rough. But uh, uh kids, <laughs> my son just came out here to tell me that uh, he got exactly the time trial in Sackboy and uh Sackboy Adventures one of the time trials he got exactly 40 seconds and that was for gold is 40 seconds and it didn't give it to him he had to have under 40 seconds so he was a little he was a little upset but <laughs> he's 10 he gets over it pretty quickly nowadays uh anyways if y'all haven't y'all haven't played that game Sackboy Adventures that game does not get enough credit i know this is a sidestep but that game is really inventive uh, innovative in a lot of the things they do. You can break vertical and you know all the patterns and stuff like that in it. If you get on something that's soft, it, it actually sinks down when you're walking in it. It's like you're walking and it's sinking. It's it's pretty ingenious game in, in, a, in a lot of ways. I know it sounds like it's for kids, but it's pretty fun, man. My, me and my and the whole and four up to four people can play it. So me and my kids and my wife and everybody plays it. It's fun. But uh, about the back to the statue. Sorry about that. Uh, very impressed with uh, Iron Studios' attention to detail, the 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 fabric, everything, or not fabric, but the uh, texture and everything else. The just overwhelming awesomeness. Like I can't believe how well they done. I wish his head would have been looking a little uh, further up, because now standing on your shelf, he's going to be looking down, so you can't really see his eyes. I was, I understand that's more of an uh, like a pose but kind of wanted it to be like a pose <laughs> still highly recommend the statue fantastic cannot wait for thunderbolts to come out in theater or on disney plus or whatever they decide to do because you never know with the mcu anymore they do whatever the heck they want to and you just got to go along with the ride so all right hope you enjoy the review appreciate you guys stopping by watching everything Check out the links below. Hit the like, hit the subscribe. You guys take care, have a good one, and remember, 